is up guys welcome to a new spooky youtube video and in today's video we're gonna have a look at exclusive leaks that we've received in our mailbox from bloodstrike it's literally a letter that includes some clues and with those clues came a leaked image of what we can expect for the next update the update is dropping the 17th of october and it's gonna be absolutely insane we're gonna have a new weapon the car 98k we're gonna have a new battle pass we're gonna have a new event mode and so much more guys there's also also gonna be free rewards so don't worry free to play players your time is here to shine but let's have a look at what the leaks are and let's dive into the video so we received a letter from tio blood now correct me if i'm wrong tio means uncle in spanish uh i know that because i watched breaking bad uh, and you know the old guy uh, with the bell that's tio <laughs> anyway um Listen, uh, here we have the image. Uh, we're going to go from left to right and see what we can find out. So all the way uh, top left, we have the Bloodstrike logo. But under the Bloodstrike logo, we seem to have some napkins and maybe a sharp object under that. I'm not entirely sure. If we go down a little bit, we have a magnifying glass, which, um, you know, obviously, since we're investigating, that, that relates to us. And then we also see a heavy bullet. Now, a heavy bullet definitely definitely relates to the car 98k so uh that is a nice teaser there and then we also have the envelope with uh you know the blood strike logo with Ethan on it and then we have it sealed as well so we have a sealed letter uh we have for some reason uh an arrow that you know points to the letter so i think i guess we just have to open it and then on the top right we have a plate with something on it i don't know if that's eatable um it actually kind of looks like a pumpkin if you squeeze your eyes just a little bit, you know? Uh, then we also have a candle, and then on the bottom right, we also have a few objects, but I can't really, really see what that is. And of course, we have a pen, so uh, I don't know. Maybe maybe we write back to Tia Blood, you know? Who knows? Um, right, let's open up the letter, and let's see what's inside. All right, here goes the letter. Dear agents, I heard you all are investigating my party starting the 17th of October. Well, let me give you some hints. So, it looks like we have five clues, and under that, we have some more text. Some clues are real, and some are fake. Use the images I sent to figure it out. Haha, <laughs> trick or treat. Okay, so on this image alone, we have a pumpkin. We see some gravestones with some candles on it, um, and it's very, very dark. So, that would definitely relate to... Uh, the nighttime maps that they tease in the dev Q&A that I made a video about a while ago. Um, so if you haven't seen that yet, definitely go and check that out as well. Um, and also, this letter is signed by yours truly, T.O. Blood. So we now have an uncle in Bloodstrike, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Um, so let's see what is the first clue. Uh, the first clue is there's a new mode and it's super fun. So let's see if we can figure out if the new mode is actually visible on that image. Okay, so... Straight off the bat, on this image, there is so much things going on, okay? So let's just talk a little bit about what is going on in the image. Um, there is a whole, a whole like, chapel in the background. Um, that could be, like, a new kind of, like, uh, map for the new event mode. That could be, like, a first clue. We also have, um, you know, it's nighttime. So definitely nighttime mode would also be a thing. Um, we see a flying witch. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna be flying in Bloodstrike now. Uh, maybe. Dude, that would kind of be lit, not gonna lie. <laughs> Seeing someone, like, fly across the sky. Anyway, we're, we're, we're derailing. Um, now, if we go from left to right, we can definitely see that there's a man in the background. Who is that? And what are they doing there? So, that to me looks like either a new character, a zombie, or a skin. And, oh no, wait. Oh my god, if you actually zoom in, it looks like Nacho. Wait, wait, wait. If you actually zoom in on this character, this guy has necklaces like Nacho does. So that is definitely Nacho. But is that zombie Nacho for a new event mode? Or is that zombie Nacho a new skin? Or is that zombie Nacho a free reward? I don't know. Time will tell. Dude, that is very, very cool looking, though. Not gonna lie to you guys, that... 100% that is Nacho. 100% that's Nacho. Okay, anyway, let's see what else is in the image. So, we have Nacho over here being dead. Then we have a bunch of pumpkins, and we see 
a bunch of real pumpkins and then we see a pixelated uh, pumpkin. We can also see that there's a bunch of uh, tombstones over here, which could also relate to uh, zombies. And then there's also a bunch of tools to dig graves. And that is, I think, what the main character is doing over here. The guy uh, with the big pumpkin, the side, I think he is actually digging a grave with the side. But why is he doing that? Or, or he not digging, digging up or digging it for someone? I don't know. But anyway, um, other than that, we have uh, another fake pumpkin over here on the right side. And then we also have... Um, dude, what is the character called? The guy with the, like, big hoodie and then, like, the big side. I don't know what it's called. Anyway, uh, we have a lot of candles in the area. And it's nighttime. So, back to the clue. The clue said that there's a new event mode. So, for me, that means either the chapel is a clue. Uh, the nighttime is a clue. But it could also be the zombie being a clue. So I think around those three things, we might have a new event mode. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, it could be an entirely new mode that we've never seen before. Um, I mean, it did say new mode and not zombie mode uh, that we've already seen from last year, right? So uh, very, very interesting. Um, but let's move on to the next clue. So we are back at the letter over here. And the next clue is something from another dimension is on the way. And the art style is totally different. Okay, that is going to be a very, very easy one to figure out because um, we saw the pumpkins, right? So let's go back to the image. Okay, so we have the pixelated pumpkin and then we have the 2D pumpkin. Now, the 2D pumpkin, bro, I don't know who did this photoshopping, but we can still see the pumpkin behind it. <laughs> anyway, uh, that is kind of funny. Um, but so we have two fake pumpkins and then we also have the, the character over here, the, the side guy. Um... So what does that mean? Is that real or is that fake? Because in the letter, it did say that some of the clues are going to be real and some of them are going to be fake. So this, to me, either means that we're going to see some collaborations, you know, uh, Bloodstrike uh, with Minecraft, for example, because of the pixelated stuff, or Bloodstrike with something else, I don't know. Or it just means that it's a fake clue. I'm going to go with the second one. I think it's a fake clue. And they just put this in there, um, you know, to throw us off, okay? Definitely, definitely, <laughs> they, they are trying to bait us, guys. They're trying to bait us. All right, let's move on to the next clue. The next clue is called a new emote, a flying broom. Oh, my God. Okay, let's go back to the image. Man, this is going to be like... <sighs> okay, just remember, guys, it could be real clues or fake clues, okay? I'm going to say that this is real. I think that we're going to actually get an emote in the game that will make you fly on a broom. <gasps> Bro, wait. I just realized this. You know, in other games, they actually have uh, emotes. Uh, and when you use the emote, you can still move. We call those emotes traversal emotes. Because you can literally travel while using them. If that is the case in Bloodstrike, that is a huge W, bro. We are actually... Like, this is it. This is it. I think we're going to have a broom emote. And it's going to be a new kind of emote that we've never seen before in Bloodstrike. Where you can emote and then move at the same time. Bro, if that's the case, I can't wait to, like, be zooming with a broom across, like, my knocked enemies, bro. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. Someone stop me. Okay, let's move on to the next clue. Okay, the next clue is striker's head dot dot dot. That's it. Um, okay, let's go back to the image. What is up with the striker's heads? Okay, so obviously we have the, the mystery man with the pumpkin head over here digging a grave. He has a insane big head, okay? Like, insane. But what does that mean? Like, that doesn't really mean anything, right? Like, if we are gonna have big heads like that with a new sniper coming out, bro, we're not gonna have a good time because everyone's about to get headshotted. I think this is kind of like another clue to throw us off. Not gonna lie to you guys. The striker's heads. Oh, or maybe it's like with the new event mode, there's some kind of like thing that happens like you know if you die you get like a pumpkin head or something oh no wait wait okay maybe i have another id that <laughs> and this is gonna sound ridiculous but i'm just throwing it out there but like imagine we have an event mode where you know every time you die your head grows bigger into a pumpkin bro that would be hilarious <laughs> okay i don't know what this clue means let me know in the comments down below all right, and then we have the final clue, which says, Will I be meeting you all? 
Okay, listen, we're gonna have a look at the image one last time. Guys, I don't know about you guys, but I am super, super stoked for this new Halloween event. It looks like we are getting so, so much content. It looks absolutely amazing. New event mode, nighttime changes, new weapon, new battle pass, new free rewards, hopefully as well. And uh, yeah, man, I'm super, super excited. I can't help it. And also guys, this upcoming Saturday on my live stream, I will be making a huge, huge announcement in regards to this Halloween month for Bloodstrike. And uh, you guys will not want to miss it, bro. It is, uh, it's going to be crazy. I am super, super hyped, not only for the patch, but also what is to come after the patch uh, regarding this big announcement. So definitely stay tuned. Hit that notification bell because you won't want to miss it. If you cannot make it to the live stream, don't worry. I will be making community posts and uh, I will also be making an announcement on Discord. But, you know, living the moment live with the whole of the community is a next level feeling. Um, so I really, really hope to see you guys in my live stream this saturday for that big announcement and uh, yeah man these are the clues that we got for this halloween patch if i didn't see something in the images please let me know in the comments down below i really hope you guys uh, can help me spot out some more things that would be really really nice and uh, i appreciate you guys watching i appreciate a lot of people sticking with blood strike because i know the past month um a lot of people have been disappointed in regards to content and uh, new releases but i think this new patch is gonna re literally just reignite your passion for this game i know for me it definitely did um so yeah man i'm excited and i'll see you guys in the next video